Welcome to an exploration of the Plain of Jars, a megalithic archaeological mystery in Laos. This enigmatic site has captivated researchers since its discovery in the 1930s, with thousands of megalithic jars scattered across nearly a hundred locations in northern Laos. Recent studies have revealed that some of these massive jars could be more than 3,000 years old. The human remains found alongside them were buried between 700 and 1200 years ago, indicating the sites held ritual significance for a long time. The jars, made mostly of sandstone, granite, and limestone, were likely crafted using iron chisels, although enough evidence for this remains inconclusive. Local legends suggest they were created by a race of giants to store rice wine for a great feast celebrating a military victory. Several theories have been proposed about the purpose of the jars. Some speculate that they were designed to capture rainwater during monsoon season for use by passing caravans, but most archaeologists believe they were used as funerary urns. Excavations have supported this idea with human remains, burial goods, and ceramics found near the jars. The bodies would have been left to decompose in the jars before being cremated and having their ashes returned to the urns or buried in a sacred place. Recent discoveries have expanded our understanding of the site, with 137 new examples of massive jars found in 15 new locations. This suggests that there may be thousands more jars spread across the entire site. The diversity of burial styles indicates that several different cultures may have used the site for mortuary practices. Beautifully carved discs, possibly burial markers, have been found with geometric images of concentric circles, human figures, and animals. Unfortunately, the Plain of Jars is also one of the most dangerous archaeological sites in the world due to the thousands of tons of unexploded bombs, landmines, and other military ordnance scattered throughout the area. These munitions contaminate over 35% of the province's total land area and continue to threaten the lives of the 200,000 people who now live in Zhangquang. Despite the dangers and the many unanswered questions, the Plain of Jars remains a fascinating and enigmatic destination for archaeologists and history enthusiasts alike. As research continues, we can hope to uncover more insights into this ancient site and the people who created and used these mysterious jars. Continuing our exploration of the Plain of Jars, we delve further into the mystery of its origins and the culture behind it. The discovery of human remains, ceramics, and other artifacts in proximity to the jars has led researchers to believe that the site was primarily used for burial practices. However, many questions remain. For example, how were these massive jars, some weighing up to 10 metric tons, transported from their quarry to their final resting places up to 10 kilometers, 6.2 miles away. Some speculate that they were dragged on wooden rollers or sledges, but concrete evidence is yet to be found. The jars themselves give little clue to the culture that created them. Although iron chisels were likely used in their manufacture, no definitive evidence has been discovered. Additionally, the diverse range of mortuary practices observed at the site has puzzled researchers as such, diversity within a single culture is uncommon. This raises the question of whether multiple cultures used the Plain of Jars for their burial customs. The recent discovery of new jars and sites suggests that the full extent of the Plain of Jars is yet to be uncovered. With potentially thousands more jars waiting to be found, our understanding of this enigmatic location continues to evolve. The Plain of Jars is a testament to the persistence and determination of researchers who continue to work in this dangerous landscape as they navigate the risks posed by unexploded ordnance and other hazards. Their findings provide valuable insights into this ancient site and the people who once inhabited it. As more discoveries are made, we can hope for a clearer understanding of the culture and history behind the mysterious Plain of Jars. As research on the Plain of Jars progresses, we can't ignore the local legends that offer their own explanations for the site's existence. One such story speaks of a race of giants, led by a king who needed a place to store his rice wine. The wine was intended for a grand feast, 
to celebrate a victorious battle that took place thousands of years ago. Another theory put forth by some specialists suggests that the jars were designed to capture rainwater during the monsoon season, which would later be boiled and used by caravans passing through the region. However, the majority of archaeologists lean toward the belief that the jars were used as funerary urns, based on the evidence of human remains and the burial goods found in the vicinity. The diversity of burial styles at the Plain of Jars continues to baffle researchers, who hope to establish the reasons for these different practices. Intriguingly, beautifully carved discs featuring geometric images of concentric circles, human figures, and animals have been found buried face down alongside the jars. Some researchers suggest that these discs may have served as burial markers, although it is important to note that most human deposits were made much later than the creation of the jars. The ongoing investigation of the plane of jars is hampered by the very real dangers present at the site. Unexploded bombs, landmines, and other military ordnance from the Vietnam War contaminate a significant portion of the province posing a constant threat to the 200,000 inhabitants of Zhang Quang and the archaeologists working in the area. Despite these challenges, the study of the Plain of Jars continues to reveal new findings and offer glimpses into the lives and customs of the people who once inhabited this region. With each new discovery, we come one step closer to unraveling the mysteries of this ancient and enigmatic site. The dedicated efforts of researchers ensure that our understanding of the Plain of Jars and its purpose will continue to grow, shedding light on the fascinating story of this unique location in Laos. The Plain of Jars is not only significant for its archaeological value, but also for its potential as a tourist attraction. The site has been gaining international attention, and as more information becomes available, it is likely to draw even more visitors eager to witness these ancient marvels firsthand. However, the danger of unexploded ordnance must be addressed before tourism can safely flourish in the region. Efforts have been made to clear the area of unexploded bombs and landmines, but much work remains to be done. Collaboration between the Laotian government, international organizations, and researchers could help expedite the process of making the site safe for both archaeologists and tourists alike. The development of sustainable tourism infrastructure could also benefit the local economy, providing a valuable source of income for the people of Zhang Quang. The Plain of Jars remains one of the most enigmatic archaeological sites on Earth. The origins of these massive stone jars and the people who created them continue to puzzle researchers, as do the diverse burial practices and artifacts found at the site. The future of the Plain of Jars relies on ongoing research, collaboration, and the development of a sustainable tourism industry that ensures the preservation of this unique and mysterious cultural heritage. As we unlock more secrets of this fascinating site, we deepen our understanding of the people who once called this region home and gained valuable insights into the rich tapestry of human history. New findings at the Plain of Jars are continually reshaping our understanding of the site, and the importance of this archaeological mystery cannot be overstated. As we continue to study the megalithic jars and the surrounding area, we may uncover additional clues to the ancient civilization that once thrived in the region. With each discovery, we enhance our knowledge of the past and broaden our perspective on the world's cultural heritage. Additionally, as we work to clear the land of unexploded ordnance, we may find more sites containing stone jars or other artifacts that could further shed light on the people who created them. The expansion of archaeological research in the area could lead to new partnerships, innovative methods of exploration, and groundbreaking discoveries that may have far-reaching implications for our understanding of ancient history. The Plain of Jars remains a captivating enigma that continues to draw the attention of archaeologists, historians, and curious travelers from around the globe. As we strive to uncover the secrets of this remarkable site, we also celebrate the incredible achievements of the ancient civilization that once called this region home. In doing so, we honor their memory and ensure that the legacy of the Plain of Jars endures for generations to come. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating journey into the mysteries of the past.